Here is another question that relates to the concept of statistical process control or control charts. A data point outside the upper control limit on the R chart that is R control chart indicates A variability is out of control, B process is not centered, C process is not normal and D it represents data collection error. Now if you understand control chart most control charts would have the average on the top and especially the continuous control charts and at the bottom you would either have a range a moving range or a standard deviation at the bottom so in this case of a range chart in this case we have used subgroups so let's assume the subgroup size is uh, 4 which means every time we collect 4 samples and we find out the range the higher and the lowest value between the the difference between the highest and the lowest value of those four data points and plot that as range in the r chart and if that value falls outside the control limit the upper control limit of the range chart then what does it represent it represents that the variability which is there the within variability which is there in the subgroup is much higher so it represents the fact that variability is higher it cannot in any way indicate to you whether the process is centered or not because for you to answer that question you need to look at the upper chart which is the either the x chart or that is the x bar chart or the individuals chart which whatever the case may be we cannot really comment whether the process is normal or non normal there could be a scenario that it is actually not normal but this is not used statistically to conclude whether the data is normal or not and of course it in no way is an indication of a data collection error because it doesn't talk about the source of data or the instrument or gauge which is used for data collection.